every child should have the opportunity to play on a playground. Hernando County mom Danielle Zukowski says she wants to make Anderson Snow Park in Spring Hill more accessible for children with special needs. Her five year old daughter has cerebral palsy and hemiparesis, forcing her to have to use a walker. Today, Danielle went to the county to talk about her plans to update this park. 10 News photojournalist Jean Yeagle caught up with her. Oh boy, Iris is a very happy child, just like any other five year old. She wants to play. Good job. Her cerebral palsy is paired with the hemiparesis, which makes her right side weak. We were invited <laughs> for a birthday party. Yeah, go play. I asked her, do you want to go to the playground now? Because we had done the birthday stuff. Um, so she, yeah, she was very excited. Go ahead. Just when we got to the sand that she just couldn't do something. It just really broke my heart and I kind of wanted to share it with um, my friends and family that don't typically get to see her every day and like things like this that we do deal with um, that they don't see. Go. I wanted to get the community's involvement in it and I wanted to share it with everyone, you know, to make them aware that there was a problem here. Thankfully, the Parks and Recreation have been working really well with us. Um, we had a couple companies come out to do bids on um, replacing the substrates. They did tell me that this was the last park that was due to have the ADA compliant mulch. All the way. It's not about Iris and it's not, it, it, it's about everyone. It, it. Not just having most people that can play, this would allow all of the children to play. <laughs> You're such a good sport, Iris. And hopefully that can get resolved as soon as possible. Yeah. All right, so in addition to a gun GoFundMe, Danielle has also started a petition to try and get the Parks and Rec Department to move forward with the updates.